artificial intelligence. It powers everything from your smartphone to self-driving cars, and it's set to reshape the future. But where did this incredible technology begin? AI's story didn't start in a lab or a corporation, it began as a dream. Long before AI became a reality, it existed only in science fiction. Writers like Mary Shelley, who envisioned the artificial creature in Frankenstein, and Isaac Asimov, with his robot-filled worlds, planted the seeds of intelligent machines in the public's imagination. Creating artificial beings that could think like humans captured both fascination and fear. Yet, it wasn't until the 20th century that these sci-fi dreams began to transform into tangible ideas. In a world caught between rapid technological advancement and global conflict, pioneers of the era started asking bold questions. Could machines replicate human thought? Could they learn, reason, or even surpass human intelligence? In 1943, these questions led neurophysiologist Warren McCulloch and logician Walter Pitts to propose the first mathematical model of neural networks. Their work was groundbreaking. They demonstrated that simple electrical circuits could represent the neurons in the human brain. Although this was a theoretical model, it laid the foundation for the neural networks that would later define AI. A pivotal moment came in 1950, when British mathematician Alan Turing published Computing Machinery and Intelligence. He posed a daring question in it. Can machines think? To answer this, Turing introduced the Turing test, a revolutionary method to evaluate a machine's ability to exhibit behavior indistinguishable from a human's. It was more than just an idea, it was a challenge to the future of AI research, setting a high bar for what accurate machine intelligence could achieve. Following Turing's vision, Christopher Strachey developed one of the first AI programs in 1951. It played checkers on the Ferranti Mark I, the world's first commercially available general-purpose computer. While simple by today's standards, it marked the beginning of AI's practical applications. AI officially became a field in 1956 at Dartmouth College, where John McCarthy, Marvin Minsky, Nathaniel Rochester, and Claude Shannon organized a conference that coined the term artificial intelligence. It was when AI stepped out of the shadows of theory and became a legitimate area of scientific inquiry. In 1957, Frank Rosenblatt introduced the Perceptron, the first machine that could learn. It was based on McCulloch and Pitt's earlier work and could recognize patterns using neural networks. This breakthrough moment in AI sparked interest in machines that could learn from data. In 1965, Gordon Moore predicted that the number of transistors on a microchip would double approximately every two years, leading to exponential growth in computing power. This prediction, now known as Moore's Law, became crucial for AI's progress as increased computational power made it possible for more complex algorithms to run efficiently. In 1967, Joseph Weizenbaum at MIT created ELISA the first chatbot. Eliza mimicked human conversation using scripts and keyword recognition, paving the way for modern virtual assistants like Siri and Alexa. Despite the early excitement, the 1970s brought the first AI winter. In 1974, funding for AI research began to dry up as governments and businesses lost confidence in its potential. Overpromising and underdelivering, AI faced years of stagnation. In the 1980s, AI saw a resurgence with the development of expert systems. These programs mimicked the decision-making abilities of human experts. One of the most famous was SCON, an expert system used by Digital Equipment Corporation to configure computer systems, saving the company millions of dollars. In 1986, Jeffrey Hinton and his colleagues developed the backpropagation algorithm, a breakthrough that allowed neural networks to learn more efficiently. 
This method laid the foundation for the deep learning techniques that would revolutionize AI decades later. In 1997, IBM's Deep Blue made history when it defeated world chess champion Garry Kasparov. This was the first time an AI system beat a reigning world champion in a highly complex game, marking a turning point in AI's capability to compete with human intelligence. By 2002, AI was starting to integrate into everyday life. For the first time, commercially available robots, like the Roomba vacuum cleaner, began to hit the market, showing that AI could be useful in consumer products. AI reached a significant milestone in 2011, when IBM's Watson defeated two human champions on the quiz show, Jeopardy. Watson's ability to understand and answer natural language questions in real time was a breakthrough for AI and language processing. In 2012, deep learning revolutionized AI. A neural network designed by Jeffrey Hinton and his team won the ImageNet competition by a staggering margin, showing the world the power of deep learning and image recognition. This success kick started a new era of AI development. In 2014, AI voice assistants entered the mainstream with the launch of Amazon's Alexa. Based on natural language processing and machine learning, Alexa brought AI into homes, allowing users to interact with AI more intuitively than ever before. In 2015, Google's AlphaGo defeated human champion Go player Lee Seedall in a series of matches. Go, considered one of the most complex board games in the world, was thought to be far beyond AI's reach. AlphaGo's victory was a testament to the advancements in AI's cognitive abilities. In 2017, AI again proved its growing capabilities by outsmarting humans in a different realm poker. Libratus, an AI program developed by Carnegie Mellon University, beat the world's top poker players in Texas Hold'em, demonstrating AI's prowess in strategy and decision-making under uncertainty. In 2020, during the COVID-19 pandemic, AI played a crucial role in tracking virus spread assisting in vaccine development, and even diagnosing patients using AI-based tools. This highlighted the importance of AI in addressing global challenges. In 2021, OpenAI's GPT-3 gained widespread attention for its ability to generate human-like text, leading to debates about AI's role in creative fields. Could AI write novels, articles, or even scripts? The lines between human and machine creativity blurred. By 2022, AI's creative potential will extend further into art. AI-generated art became a phenomenon, with tools like Dolly e and Midjourney producing stunning visuals from simple text prompts. AI was also foundational in shaping the metaverse, creating digital worlds that were previously unimaginable. In 2023, AI continued to make leaps in healthcare. From predicting diseases to personalizing treatment plans, AI revolutionized how doctors diagnose and treat patients. AI-driven diagnostics have become faster and more accurate, offering hope for more effective healthcare worldwide. AI is poised to tackle even more significant challenges, such as autonomous vehicles, ethical AI, and the ever-present question, can AI genuinely think like humans? The journey from science fiction to reality is far from over. We are only at the beginning. From its origins in the imaginations of science fiction writers to its incredible evolution today, AI's story is one of ambition, innovation, and endless possibilities. If you want to explore more fascinating stories about the past, present, and future, Subscribe to Explorious Now and dive into the incredible journey of history's most remarkable innovations.